So we're going to show you how to create a custom building material uh, on the dashboard if we click on building materials and here we've got walls, roof, windows, doors, floors, it's all in there and of course this is the default list for, for walls um, and here's, uh, here's the um, custom um, list which I've, I've created and there are two ways to add a custom U value. The quickest way is to click this one here and you can simply type in the building material uh, description and the U value and go to OK and it adds it to the list. The next step would be to, um, if you didn't know the U value, to calculate the U value. So we can click here and this takes us to um, the calculation procedure. So we say external wall building material so let's say the uh, the internal uh, first material for the internal section is plaster plasterboard and the thickness is bearing in mind it is in meters so just 12.5 millimeters uh, thermal conductivity well, if you don't know thermal conductivity um, if I just put um, 0 0.25 but I can just check that so I just go to OK so to show you can easily edit it, edit this um, if I go to open thermal conductivity material list for reference just check my values are correct and here we've got the yellow column of all the conductivity materials and if I look at surfaces, we've got plasterboard there, 0 0.25. So I've, I have selected, I've typed in the correct value there. And the next one, let's uh, use um, in, insulation and just make a reference, uh, not insulation, so it's block. So we've got different types of concrete block. We've got lightweight and concrete block here. So it's 0.19. So I'm just going to do that now. So let me go to. Um, Block thickness is let's say it's a hundred mil, so it's point zero one, and then zero point one nine for the thermal conductivity. Go to OK, um, and then you can see down here it's it's slowly building up the description with the thicknesses and the U value. Of course, we haven't finished yet, so we're going to improve that one point three four value. And so let's have the insulation. Let's go back to click on the um, this button here. But it's going to open up the window because I've already had it open. And let's look at the insulation here. Let's put some Celotex in there, 0 0.022. So go to add and then go to um, just put text and thickness. Uh, let's say it's 50 mil and then 0 0.022 for the th thermal conductivity. OK that. And then finish off with um, external brickwork. Again, let's look at our. We've got brickwork outer leaf, and the thermal conductivity is 0 0.84. So add material, type in brick thickness, say 0. Point, um, say, say 200 mil, and then we go to conductivity 0 0.84 go to OK and we have now finished that and then we can go to save and it's easy you can easily um, edit as well because if we can click on brick for example we could change the thickness it's 150 mil and we could even change the thumb with resistance as well so we can override that go to OK and then it changes you go to save and it's added to the list and then it's there it is a plasterboard block set of text and brick so that's how to add a custom building material to the list